Uh, then Gaesha. Please tell me what are the things that you can do using a computer? Can you put it? Okay, I think you have a problem with your mic. Uh, then Nisuru, what give me two examples? What we can do using a computer? Play games. Ah, we can play, play games. Then store data. Ah, we can store data. Good. Then uh Savinu Pute, what is the main function of computer? What is the main function? Input, input process, and output. Very good. Then, uh, Metuka. Metuka, Puta, please give me two significant features of a computer. Two significant features of a computer. Two significant features of a computer. Any other one? Who can say significant features of a computer? Excuse me, madam. May I tell? Okay. Speed and efficiency, accuracy, uh -huh. reliability, consistency, storage capacity, cost, intelligence. Very good. Then, uh... Isuru, what is an embedded computer? What is mean by embedded computer, Puta? What is mean by embedded computer? Devices with computers to perform to perform which type of task? To perform a specific task. Okay, good. Then, uh, tell me, tell me two examples for embedded computers. You know, two examples for embedded computers. Puta. Mobile phone, washing yes. machine. Ah, very good. Mobile phone and washing machine. Then, uh, Netuka. Tell me five components in in the computer. Tell display me five Display, speaker, keyboard, mouse. Ah, display, speaker, uh, keyboard, keyboard, mouse. Good. Then, any other components? System, system unit, internet, internet router. Ah, very good. System unit and also internet router. Okay. We discuss those in those components. We can divide it into six categories. So, uh, Savino, please tell me two categories: input devices, output devices. Very good. Then, tell me, tell me another two categories: storage devices, communication devices. Very good. And Isuru, Isuru, Puta, tell me. Other two categories, remain in two categories. They told input, output, storage and communication. Two other are remaining. Main memory. Yes. Main memory. Central processing unit. Ah, very good. Central processing unit. Those are the six categories. Input devices, output devices, central processing unit, main memory, storage devices, and uh, communication devices. Okay. Uh, what is mean by input device, Netuka? The devices are with the devices which are Use uh, 
tender and instruction to computers are called input devices. Uh, devices which are used to feed instruction and data to the computer. Good. Uh, so, so tell me two examples for input devices. Two examples for input input devices. Mouse is scan mm -hmm. scan. Ah, uh, mouse and the scanner. Then uh, Savinu, what is mean by output device put them? The devices which are used to read raw information uh, are called the output devices. Ah, uh, devices which are used to retrieve information are called output devices. So Netuka, please tell me two examples for output devices. Two examples. Uh, com computer printer. Uh, computer display and printer. It should be corrected as computer display and printer. Okay. Then we discussed about uh, central processing unit. What is the short term for central processing unit, uh, Devami? Controls the computer and process data according to given instruction. Ah, okay. You told uh, the function of the CPU. It controls the computer and process the data according to the given instruction. Very good. And the short term of the CPU is central processing unit is CPU. Okay. Then we learned about okay, where we can See the CPU, uh, Netuka. Where we can see the CPU? CPU in the motherboard. Motherboard uh, in the speaker. system. Uh, it is in the uh, motherboard and inside the system unit. Very good. Uh, then, uh, what is mean by? Okay, uh, give me two other names for the main memory. Give me two other names for main memory. Uh, they'll mean. Primary memory, random access memory. Very good. Primary memory and the random access memory. Then what is mean by main memory? Savino, what is mean by main memory? The devices are used to store data and information. Information instructions uh, temporarily. Uh, the main, the most important word is temporary. In the main memory, we store data temporarily. Okay, then we learned about storage devices. So, uh, Netuka, please tell me what is storage device? The devices which are used to store data information and Instruction permanently are called called storage devices. Ah, the most important word is permanently. In the main memory, we store data temporarily, but in the storage devices, we store data permanently. Okay, very good. Then 